What's going on, everybody? Soliaka here. And I was in Clearwater, and I went to serve them an intent to sue. Um, in this intent to sue, I'll put up a couple screenshots. And what all this is, is basically giving them a chance to settle this. To Before it has to go to federal court, they have an option. They have three options that I, I'm requiring. And um, the first one... I'm asking for $10,000 per person. I serve four people, $40,000. Um, I'm also asking for them to get rid of Rule 15, um, the decorum rule. I'll put that up on the screen so you kind of have an idea what that is. And then I'm also asking for a public apology. I don't think I'm going to get any of it, which is fine. That's, that's their choice. They can look into the case law that I'm quoting, Cohen versus California. This is the shirt that I was wearing. Um, if you can see it. And uh, this is what, this is the rule that I'm supposedly breaking. Well, the Constitution's already ruled that my shirt is actually more lawful than your Rule 15. But anyway... Um, what you're going to see, about nine officers friggin' kicking out. Um, we have Caved Up Caveman. We've got Florida Audits. We've got GXXGOX. Um, and there's a guy named Lawrence. We have Mr. Haluba. Um, and there's probably a few others, but all their links will be in the description below if they have a YouTube channel. Um, we all basically got kicked out, you know. And nobody's ever happy when they violate your First Amendment right, and that's what happened, and we're going to deal with it. But without further ado, I want to get into this video. Um, yeah, and this is going to show you everything that's going on from the time that I showed up until the time all the police left. So let's do it. Don't forget, hit that like, share, and that subscribe button, all that good stuff, and I'm out. Soli Ecker. Deuces. What's going on, Banks? Hey, what's happening? Living the dream, dude. Living the dream, man. Man, I, I, I had to sit and watch. Were you there for that three hour of you just sitting around babysitting? It wasn't three hours, but yes. Oh, it was definitely, I got the body cam. But I didn't yeah, yeah, yeah. I got to sit down at some point. At least you got to sit down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, that was the most enjoyable three hours of body cam I've ever watched in my life. <laughs> was it good for you? The body cam? Of, um, remember Huluba and you guys sitting out here for like three hours babysitting? Yeah, that was that was I, that emotionally drained me because okay. I had to sit and watch that for three hours. Mm -hmm. God, you don't feel bad about it. Yeah, I don't think so. All right, whatever. All right. Have a good one. I'll see you later. I'm sure they're gonna kick me out too today. Hey, bunker. <laughs> What's up, G Money? Yeah, I'm not a big block. How you feeling? I brought you some campaign swag if you'd like it. Yeah, I'll help you out as best yeah. as I can. You, you can I can't say Bunker 2024. I know that. Well, well, yeah, you can't do that. Why not? It, it's just... No, it, 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 it's it's oh, whatever. Not a legal place to do that. Um, so, I mean, if, if you want some, not afraid. Uh, to hand out to your buddies, you're, you're welcome to them. Hey, just remember, don't be afraid. If they kick me out again, don't be afraid to say something. Well, you know, saying <laughs> something is, is one thing. Um, uh, unfortunately, um, the way that the rules of a meeting go Fuck your decor everywhere, rules. <laughs> you know, the, the mayor's in charge. The mayor. And, it, you know, I can jump to my feet Con and say... This is not right. It's yeah. not going to help it. Yeah, no, it could. Uh, there's only a couple more meetings. Yeah, There'll no. be a new mayor. Hopefully, they, they won't be as. You know, yeah, yeah. Hopefully not. Uh, you're looking great, bro. Yeah, you yeah. You really are. Appreciate looking that. Yeah, yeah. 
I remember when the first time I met him, he was at least 50 like pounds heavier. Yeah, I've lost about 90 pounds. Yeah, yeah. Good, Good for you, man. Awesome. Yeah. Keep it up. Man. Okay. I'm going to have to go put these back. In yeah, the have fun, man. Yeah. yeah, you can't be doing none of this stuff, man. Heaven forbid. Yeah, I see. Even this, I can't do anything for me. Right? I don't know who they're in their fancy uniform. Yes. They're firemen. Yeah. yeah. They're the real yeah. Do I give this to you? Thanks, sir. All right, thank you. <clears throat> I'm Mr. Haluba. Mr. Haluba, and I aggravate the thin skinned Brian Oxt. That's your first warning. You know the rules by now, Mr. Haluba. Now, the First Amendment of the U.S. Constitution safeguards several fundamental rights that are actually essential to American life. The right to petition government by individuals. They can address grievances. They can seek redress by submitting petitions to the government. This allows citizens to voice concerns, propose changes, or seek justice. <clears throat> Another part of it is the right to assemble peaceably. Citizens have the right to gather for peaceful purposes such as protests, demonstrations, or public meetings like this. The government cannot unreasonably restrict this right by coming up with a Rule 15. Now, freedom of speech, that ensures individuals can express their thoughts, opinions and ideas without fear of government censorship or punishment. This freedom extends to various forms of communication, including spoken words, written text, and artistic expressions, such as words on a t-shirt. Rule 15 is an attempt to restrict these rights. Rule 15 is a threat to democracy. Rule 15 should be vacated and repealed now. Anyone else want to write yeah, that's a hard act to follow right there. Um, I do have some paperwork. Um, clerk? What's that? Oh, my name is Michael Taylor. I'm from Port St. Lucie, Florida. Thank you very much. Um, just to let you know, Mr. Unks, what he has in his hand, you've been served. Uh, Mr. Margulies, you are now served. Uh, Mrs. Call, there is going to be one for the city. You're served. Unfortunately, the, the tyrant... Gandhi's not here, and there's one for him, too. All right, that's your first warning. Violation of Rule 15. You can either, you can either go out in the hallway and turn it inside out. You can Cohen take it versus it. California allows me to wear this shirt. Cohen versus California, the guy had... Please remove Mr. F Taylor from the, the meeting. Let's take, let's take a break. Tired. Tyrants, dude. Tire. This is no different. Tire. This is Tire. this is gonna be a second one. Tire. I know, I dude, don't. I'm yeah, getting my stuff. You, to you that you're being. I'm getting my just. Hey, just shut the front door. Leave me the front. It. This is the first one, and you're gonna get. You just got a second one. I, I, I'm leaving right now, dude. What are you talking about, dude? Try not to make um, I, shut up. Don't talk to me and I won't say nothing. That's how that's how it is. You don't talk to me. 
Fuck the police. Yeah. Oh, dude. Look at all you guys. Hi. Hi. Hold on. I'm leaving. Name and badge number. Name and badge number. Name and badge number. Name and badge number. Taylor. I'm leaving. God, Stiff, why you gotta be like this, dude? You didn't have to be like this. I didn't even serve you a friggin' lawsuit, but now that you're doing this, because I got a second one now, because you just kicked me out again, I will give you, and I can't wait to depose all of you. Look, there's like friggin' 90 y'all in here for what? Also, thanks to make sure that you guys have the numbers. Yeah, I, I get it. I gotta go outside the fucking gate, dude. F all y'all. Dude. This is unreal. Did you swear an oath to defend the rights of my of my rights? All right. Uh, yeah, I get it, dude. Go f yourself. Meanwhile. Hey, what are you talking about, dude? Try not to make it more are we in recess? Uh, shut up! Don't talk to me. I won't say nothing. Are we in recess? That's how, that's how it is. Is you that what you said? Me. What? Speak, I can't hear you. you, you. Talk like meeting, okay? Why do you I have to leave the meeting? It's in recess. Okay. There's no decorum when it's in recess, correct? When, it, when it's in recess, there is no decorum of code of conduct, correct? Do you know that? You don't understand that? No, I'm not getting into it with you. I'm back and forth. Are you, are you threatening me? I never threatened you. Okay, so I'm, I'm free to stay here. Is that what you're saying? I'm getting into it with you. The mayor asked you to leave. Okay. Are you going to arrest what, me if I do law? not leave? I never said I was going to arrest you. What okay, law? please leave me alone. Your contact okay. is non-consensual. Please leave me alone. <laughs> State or law that he violated? Ain't no law. I'm not getting back and forth with you. The mayor said you violated the rules of the court. Okay. Are you going to arrest me if I don't leave? No. Then please leave me alone. Yeah. I want you to notice who he, uh, the stiffmeister over there, who he's talking to. And that's Daniel Slaughter. He's the assistant city manager, and he is the ex-chief of police. And right now, because Gandhi's not there, Stiffmeister right there should be the leader of the police department, but he's going to, guess who he's going to? The ex-chief of police, that's the assistant manager that has no authority. And guess what's going to happen? Let's roll it. Same thing. All right, here's the deal, gentlemen. You've been issued a trespass warning. You refuse to leave. You will be arrested. The police. We're writing it up from like that out here. I want, I want to see your order. We're writing it up from the asshole. We're going to get to it. Get to us last month. And Thomas, you give me a copy of it. You never did. Still. So Gentlemen, the lever is closed. You need to leave or you'll be arrested. You, you, right you need to leave the whole building or just the no, meeting? Just no, the building. There. The building's closed. It's Why's only it open closed? for the meeting. You've the been removed from the meeting. You need to leave the building. The meeting is still going on. It's still it's closed. The public. It's a Put that bags. Don't be fucking There you go. Come on. Hey, hey. Don't push it, dude. Just go on. Piggy, piggy. Squeal for him, Hey, uh, I hope you got some good photos. I think so. <laughs> Let me know when you need some of this. I can throw you about a hundred right yeah. away. I mean, you know. We're, I'm gonna. I, I give, I'm giving them sixty days. Uh, the total amount is gonna be about forty thousand between them all, between Gandy, Gandy, Margulies, the city, and Brian Unks. I'm. Hi. That didn't take long, huh? <laughs> I didn't care. Yeah. And he just added another one too. Hey, Mr. Slaughter, thanks for taking that paperwork. But man, stay out of that book. Yeah, come on. Hey, can I, can you tell me what you're reading when you're when you're not paying attention to the, the public speaking? Um, it's actually in my notes. Your notes? Nice, man. What are you taking notes on? How to friggin' violate people's First Amendment rights and stuff? No, no, I don't take notes on that. Yeah, you're you're pretty good at it. Thank you. Yeah, you're you're you're, you're welcome. Man, where, where's Gandhi at? I, I miss Gandhi. I was I was hoping to get him served today too, but I guess I'll have to come back. He's at home getting dinner. Not anymore. <laughs> have a good one, Mrs. Slaughter. Get some rest. Go up next hey, to Gandhi. Depositions don't not include you. My sister? Me too. Yeah, it's it's unfortunate that she ruined her life.
Now, with this part, I really, if if Daniel Slaughter's being genuine about the concern about my sister, you know, I have concern for my sister, but my sister has done, she did the damage to herself. This has been an ongoing thing for her whole life, and it's unfortunate. But if Daniel Slaughter's being serious and he actually has concern about my sister, I appreciate it. But for some reason, I think he's not genuine, but I don't know. So I'm going to take it at face value, and if it's genuine, I appreciate it. So we'll keep going. It really is. Thanks <coughs> Thanks for the concern. I don't know where. Don't, don't that, know that, proves me, that just proves to me that they're watching my YouTube channel because he knows about my sister. My YouTube channel. Because I, I I did a video about it. Yep, you did. And uh, I made it very clear that my sister my sister's dying. She's she she refuses to go to hospice. She refuses to friggin' not fucking do fentanyl and bullshit. And if that's what she wants, then she she dug her own grave. It's her life. I can't change it. <laughs> it happens, dude. Uh, here it comes. Look how many there are. Look, look at the amount of law enforcement. Oh, sorry, 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 buddy. Yeah. There is literally like six, seven of them right here. What, seven of them? Minimum. There, I think there was a total of nine.